Hi guys, welcome to Daddy Dye's Crafty Corner. Tonight I'm going to be sharing with you a um, pre-order that I ordered from the Not Too Shabby Shop, Jamie's Shop here on YouTube. And um, the reason that I'm going to share this with you is because I went ahead and placed my pre-order today. And there's a few things I think you may not know, and I'm going to get into all of those as we go along. You're going to see a little glare on this side of the iPad because I have my lights on. Um, as you guys may know, we've had some foul weather moving that moved in yesterday and today into South Florida. It did a lot of damage um, in Georgia as well when it moved through. <clears throat> so, of course, my prayers are going out to those families and loved ones um, for healing because that was a bad, a bad thing that happened there. And um, so I don't have a lot of sunlight today, but I wanted to film some videos because the kids are being extremely good today. And I'm actually not coughing every five seconds, so that's a plus. And I was excited when I went online this morning when I had my coffee and saw that there were a couple of companies doing pre-orders for Lawn Fawn. Okay, so the Lawn Fawn CHA stuff, if you've been seeing it, it's pretty cute, guys. It's pretty cute. So I thought that I would come on and tell you why. Um, last year, I waited. I didn't want to put out the money that I was going to spend in Lawn Fawn a month ahead of time. I just wanted to wait and till it came out and then everybody got their stuff. I and I couldn't order it from Jamie's shop at that time because she had already sold out. So I ended up having to place my order with um, Lawn Fawn and I got most of what I wanted and I got it way later than everybody else and I had to pay shipping. So with the other company right now that's offering the pre-order, you have to pay shipping as well. So you're going to pay, you know, your $6 or $7 in shipping. And with Jamie's shop, there is no shipping over, I think it's $50. Don't quote me on that. Um, my order was kind of large, so I know that there was no shipping on it. But also you're saving 10% on all of these items, which nobody else offers. Nobody. Not to mention, none of these other places, unless you are an extremely large YouTuber making them tons of money, give you the time of day. They don't follow you. They don't follow your Instagram. They don't follow your YouTube channel. They do not support your channel. They don't comment on your videos. Jamie supports our YouTube com community with all of her heart and soul. I see it here on YouTube all the time. So, like I told you guys with my New Year's resolution, I'm going to start giving my money to those people I feel appreciate us here in the community who follow us and who support us. And though that's where I'm going to do my purchases. So, with that being said, I placed my order today. Now, I am super excited about the Lawn Fawn release. You guys know I always am. And even though I don't keep my stuff forever, you guys know that, I love it while I have it. So please know that. When I place an order, I love these products. I'm going to use them. I use them in different projects. And then I keep a copy. I stamp it out. On I've showed you that. I stamp it out. I keep a copy for one more project if I want to make it. And I let it go. So that's normally how I do things. Now, I had been obsessed with Lawn Fawn. I had everything. I had all the dyes, and that's mostly why I started letting the, that, the Lawn Fawn go, because I knew I didn't want to keep the dyes anymore. I love my brother's scan and cut, so I didn't order any of the matching dyes for this. All right, <clears throat> so I'm just going to go in, and I'm going to show you what is available. Now keep in mind, guys, that you can save 10% on this. They're going to ship on February 22nd. And I know from experience that you get your order from Jamie much quicker than you get it from anybody else. And I'm super excited about that. Super excited about that. So there is a bicycle built for two set that has this cute, I'm just going to blow it up a little bit, which has these cute little figures that looks like the little mermaids. 
Um, they got little legs, which is super exciting because I've been making my mermaids having legs. So now I don't have to do that anymore, although they're not standing, they're sitting on a bike, but that's okay. It's doable. Cute little puppy and kitten, a bike, um, balloons, a hat, just all kinds of stuff. So I ordered that. Of course, there are matching dyes. I did not order the dyes. This cute elephant. Super cute elephant and a little baby elephant. Well, you know that was going to have to happen. So I ordered that with the little mouse and the bird and the cake. It says, sorry, I forgot. It's just so stinking adorable. Um, I, they has the matching dyes, of course. She has everything. The entire, the only thing I didn't see on her site was there some new card stocks out right now as well. And I did not see the card stocks on her site and I do want the card stock, so I'm going to have to find those. But I do have a gift certificate that I got for my birthday from Lawn Fawn. So I may order just the card stocks that I want for this year with that gift certificate. So that may happen there. Um, this one is called Meow. Meow You Doing. This one's called um, this one's called Elfie Selfie. And it also has this cute little camera right here that you can make her taking a picture of herself. I forgot to show you that. Okay, this one's called Bicycle Built for You, and then this one is called Meow You Doing. Like, how are you doing, but Meow You Doing. Those cats are adorable. I love how it has the little catfish, the little tuna can with the candle in it. Oh my goodness, for all of us that actually celebrate our pet's birthday, how cute is that? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It's adorable. So I ordered that. I did not order the So Cute, the Sewing in... Sewing with love. Um, I, I just, I didn't find a reason to have that. So I didn't order that one, but this one, the out of the world, the little space character with the <coughs> planets and the rocket rockets. Oh my goodness, guys. In love. I am in love. I cannot wait to get my hands on that. That's called out of this world. And I did order that. Like I said, the reason that I'm showing you these is so that you know, if you haven't already been to the site, you know to go look and pick up those few things that you do want. Um, I did not order any of this that you're looking at right now. There's a sloth that hangs in a tree. Um, I'm not a big sloth person. I don't really find them to be cute and cuddly, so I did not get that one. Has matching dyes as well. Um, it's got a really nice jelly bean and jar set, which I thought was super stinking cute. I, however, did not get that as well. I have got so many jar things and jelly bean things that I could make that myself. So I did not get that one. It also has the shaker add-on feature, which is awesome. So you can make it a shaker card. Um, again, I feel like I could do that on my own if I really wanted to. So but you, you can get the cut, the lawn cuts, and you can get the shaker add-on. So that is awesome. Um, I did get the, of course, the Happy Easter, and I got the Fab Flower. So this is like a little dimensional flower set. It's not as, um, it's just simple. It's very simple, and I kind of really like that. And then, of course, I had to get the little Happy Easter with a little bunny that can hold the basket, the egg, or the carrot, or really anything else that you have in those little characters that hold something. All those other things we have will fit in that arm. So that's super cool. I did not get the matching dies. <coughs> All right, what did I get here? I didn't get any of this, but there's a new sentiment, the happy, happy, happy which goes along with the happy, happy, happy dies. Super cute. Both those sets are really cute, but I'm trying to weed out my sentiments as we speak. I did do a de-stash on some of them, and I still have a lot more to go, guys. Um, there's a new Bannertastic. I think the last one was Bannerific. This one's Bannertastic. There are some really cute designs in these banners. Um, there are also some dies for new banners on this on this as well. These are the ones that go with this, but there are some other ones as well that I'm going to show you. And then this goes along with all of our oven stuff. Um, bun in the oven. It's got bread, uh, muffins, cinnamon rolls, a mitten. Congrats, it's a boy. Bun in the oven, all of that. Um, it's twins, it's a girl. Really kind of cute. I did not get that. And the matching dies. 
I did, of course, get year seven, the pinata. Um, I think that pinata is stinking cute. And how fun is that going to be to color up in really bright colors? I did not get the dyes, though. Okay, next. So there's a new planner. Plan on its birthdays. And that's super cute. One of the things I did like about this, I did not get it. Um, because I don't really like to decorate, but I like the fact that it had some numbers that you could color different colors and the word party that you could also color in and then all of those other aspects to add in. So that is a super cute stamp set for anyone who does planners. I did, however, have to get this fancy box die. Now this fancy box die, it, it makes a box that is the perfect size for a gift card, but it's an actual box. It's about maybe... There's a camera, maybe about that thick when it stands up. And um, you can make these windows in it so the, so the, not participant, so that the person you give the card to can see, or give the box to, can see what's in it. I think that's great. I love the scallop detailing. Yeah, we could all make this box, but it would be a little more challenging to um, make the scalloped edges around it. It would take more time, and I really like having this one piece die. So um, a little pricey at $39, but I did go ahead and pick that up. Okay, so the scalloped bar box card pop up. I know a lot of you are going to go crazy for this die. A lot of you are going to go nuts for it. So it's one of those that you, it pops up your little elements on the inside of a square box. So you guys can go look at the pictures on that. Jamie's got some pictures on her site if you click on it. Super cool. I did not get that one because I really just don't like the pop-up boxes. I've made a few and I can make them just fine so I don't have a need for that die. Okay, so to go along with the inside pop-up theme of a card, we now have the Flower Hillside pop-up add-ons, which are super, super cute. I did not get these yet. I'm considering them. I didn't get them yet. Um, but it gives you the two pieces. It's in that um, standard hillside that she does. I love it. Um, I like that it pops up. I don't see why we couldn't use it on the outside of a card as well. Of course you could. And um, I'm really considering this. But I want to try something with the houses and the trees I already have. I want to try something before I pull the trigger on that. But those are awesome. So the little town pop-up add-on. And the hillside pop-up add-ons, I think those are fantastic, but I did not purchase them yet. Also have a gra grassy hills pop-up add-on as well. And we now have a simple grassy hillside, which is just a hill. Now, I did not get this one because I already have one by another company that's a hill and is grass. So I really don't need, I don't need, I have too many. You know what I'm saying? Um, I did, however, pick up this road. So we get two road ones, road borders now, which are six inches long. Um, fantastic. You're going to get the piece that makes the, the dot, dot, dots in the middle. And you're going to either get a hill or you can get the swervy hill, the road hillside, which is the one I picked up right here. Oh, sorry about that, guys. That's the one I picked up. I think that's going to be a super addition because I do do a lot of um, cards with, you know, cars and stuff on them which also was a great one for the bicycle okay the little picket fence border now you guys know I already have two little picket fences but I did pick this up because it matches the curve of everything else I have so I'll probably de-stash at least one or the uh, one or an, or both of the other little picket fence ones once I get this in I did also pick up the happy hatchlings now this makes a a little um, duckling and some Easter eggs that you can put on the front of cards or party boxes or whatever. Um, again, I thought it was super cute. Um, it's $19. I did also pick up some stuff from another company that I'll be showing you and then you guys can kind of make up your mind what you like best. But um, I just thought this was super, super stinking cute. I like the idea of using it on baby cards, which was the example given when you click on this. And um, I just thought that was super cute to go along with a couple of these other dies that she has in. I also picked up the Easter border that says Happy Easter. And here's the other one. We now have It's a Boy and It's a Girl scripty border. I love those. Love them. I picked up those. 
and I picked up the embroidered hello and the embroidered thanks. So this is new to Lawn Fawn. You stamp this, you cut this out on your card front and then you're going to sew with your embroidery thread in the holes to make it say hello or thanks. You guys know, I love this. I do it all the time. I love, love, love it. I am super excited and they're only $7 a piece. With the holes already in it, I don't have to do it myself, so I'm super excited about that. So I did pick up both of those. Also have the words, the scripty word, happy. I did not get that because really I'm not using these big words too much anymore. And the fancy folded banners I passed on, but I'm telling you they're super cool. I already have these two, basically these two shapes on the top here from another company, but this one folds like a Z. This bottom one folds like a Z. And I think that's super, super cool. So I may sometime in the future go ahead and pick that up. All right, what's next? Okay, I only picked up a few things right here. I did pick up this window and I'm gonna tell you why. I think the window design itself is super cute. I like that it has the little glass on the front of the window. Of course, those flowers pop out. They don't stay there. They're flowers for you to put on the front of these flowers down here and you get the window box and you get the flowers and this window opens up so you can put your little characters inside the window mm-hmm that is awesome so i picked that up i also picked up the starry skies die this is just a small little triangle of stars that you can put on all four corners or two corners um it's it's small i think it's awesome so i picked that up we have the slide on over circles which are for your you know your activity cards and circles I already have from another company circles in that so I didn't need those and these are called the zigzag circle stackables so it's kind of like the stitch on your sewing machine the zigzag stitch um, I I didn't pick up any of those because to be very honest I don't like that look so I didn't pick up any of those I did however pick up the perfectly plaid rainbow Petite 6x6 and the Watercolor Wishes 6x6. I got both of those. I think that they're absolutely stunning. The colors are beautiful. I do have some watercolor paper by another company, so I'm very eager to see how this compares and how it looks. I think it's got gorgeous colors. And then we have new inks. So I did pick up the ballet slippers. The Bubble Gum. The Peachy Keen. The Minty Fresh the moonstone and the grape soda but guess what else guys she now is coming out in cubes so there are 11 a piece you get four of them and you get the little cubes like so many of the companies are going with i did not pick up any of those because i already have the full size ink pad and i have my um alta new and the small ones and my Distress things also in small and large. So I just don't want them in small. I this is my preferred ink the lawn fawn and the Alta new are my for my preferred stamping inks That's what I go to um, And I enjoy picking up all the colors as they come out. Let's see if there's anything else And that's it. So that is the entire collection and what I decided to buy from the collection now like I said the reason I decided to show you guys this is not to brag is not to say hey look what I'm getting but it's to show you that um, one I am staying true to what I promised and I'm gonna start shopping whole pretty much wholeheartedly from companies that support me from companies that support us for companies that treat us well here on our site which is YouTube or on other social medias so that's something that is very dear to my heart and that is something that Jamie does. She treats every one of us with extreme kindness and warmth and respect and she engages with us on our social media. So I want to show her the respect and that's why I'm showing you this. So if you're going to place an order for Lawn Fawn, why not save the 10%? Why not get free shipping if your order is large enough and why not... Um, support someone who supports us in the community. Also guys, if you're going to be paying with a credit card and not your PayPal account, you still go through the process like you were paying 
with your PayPal account. So you're going to go down where it shows select payment. It's going to show you an option only to pay with PayPal. You're going to go ahead and click the PayPal part of it and go to the next page and that's where you're going to see the little sign that says if you're paying with a credit card just select the debit or credit card payment and then it, you're still going to have to log into your PayPal account but it's going to charge the credit card that you want it to charge so you don't have to just use PayPal I know that was a little bit confusing to me so I thought I would share it with you um, and um, it'll help you to be able to order more often. I know it will me. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.